Well, we decided to open Fuel um, just to give the kids more self-esteem. Uh, most of these kids I've been coaching for almost three years, some two, one year. Um, we wanted to give them something to be proud of. Um, so we got our gym. It's about 10,000 square feet. Um, we're probably going to add a second floor next year because we're growing so rapidly. We're going to have two half-season teams starting. Um, it's their gym, not mine. I did it for them. Um, I believe in these kids. And I did gymnastics from when I was two to when I was 13, and it was basically my entire life, and I was obsessed with it. And Lauren saw me at the gym and asked me to be a part of her team, and I was excited to be able to try something new and be a part of the team experience, and it's been great. Last November, I tore my right labrum, and I had surgery on it in the beginning of June. I've been in ther physical therapy um, since then, and I'm doing lots of strength training and finally able to stunt now and slowly getting back to tumbling. And talk about uh, being a part of this new gym and so how excited if you're... Okay. Go ahead. Um, I'm really happy for Lauren to be able to start her new gym, and I think Fuel Athletics is going to be a great experience for her and all of us. And it's it's an honor to be able to be a part of like the first group of teams that she has here. I won cheerlead because I was about four years old and I thought cheerleaders were the coolest thing in the world and I was like, I want to be like them when I grew up. So that was my motivation to start. And the biggest thing is tumbling because a lot of our girls are really self-conscious about their tumbling and how it looks and things like that. So I really want to boost their confidence by like giving motivational speeches and like encouraging them and even taking them aside and telling them how great they are and things like that to really boost their self-confidence.